So, what is William Miller famous for? Well, he was a Baptist preacher. He was best known for founding the movement of the Second Coming of Christ, also known as the Advent Movement. This movement, which was started by him, he was, he was deeply concerned about the questions of death and afterlife. So how did he answer these questions? Well, through much prayer and Bible studies, he discovered the truth about a second coming of our Savior in Daniel chapter 8. This was about the 2300-day prophecy. He unfortunately didn't tell it to the world right away. He wrestled with God for 13 years before he told it to them. However, unfortunately, he didn't quite interpret the scriptures in the way that we know it today. He thought that the sanctuary that Daniel chapter 8 was talking about, it was talk he thought it was talking about earth being the sanctuary and how it was going to be cleansed from sin. But it wasn't that. It was that Jesus was actually moving from the holy place to the most holy place. But many people still believe that the second coming. And so on October 22nd, 1844, the great disappointment happened. Even though he was greatly disappointed, he said, how tedious and lonesome the hours while my Jesus savior delays. I have sought him in all solitude's bounders, and I have looked for him in all the long days. Yet he lingers, I pray, tell me why his chariot no sooner returns. To see him in the clouds of the sky, my soul with intensity burns. I long to be with him at home, my heart swallowed up in his love, on the fields of New Eden to roam, and to dwell with my Savior above. William Miller said that this year, 1844, was the happiest year of his life. His heart was full of glad expectation, along with a lot of others. But he had pity on those who, discouraged, who were discouraged and had no hope in Jesus after this. Even after the great disappointment, he wrote these words, I have fixed my mind on another time, on another time. And here I mean to stand until my God gives me more light. And that is today, today. Today until he comes, I have fixed my mind on another time, on another time. So, William Miller, he was great. He was one of the founding fathers of the Adventist community that we know today. Aren't you glad that he started it? Yes.